Hi, this is Gary from Cooler Solutions. I'd like to take a minute today to introduce you to a new feature that I've added to the Cooler SQL stack set. This feature allows you to limit the number of rows that gets displayed in your RapidWeaver project or on your web page while using the Cooler SQL stacks. Previously, if you had, um, let's say you had 20 rows in your database and you used this stack, then the stack would display all 20 rows. And while that's good for a lot of reasons and a lot of purposes, there were many of you that were literally uh, begging for me to add a feature that allowed you to limit the number of rows or a range of rows that gets displayed. And I'm very happy to say that we've now done that. So with version 1.2.0, you can tell the stack to uh, limit what actually gets displayed from your database. So let me show you how it works. I'm, I'm in my uh, demo site here in RapidWeaver. I'm going to uh, page number two, and you can see that I am displaying content from a sample database that I've created um, on my web server. And basically, I have six items in this database. And they're, um, uh, I just took the first six presidents of the United States, and I added a picture of them, their name, um, an imaginary phone number, and I've added some information here about them, and that gets displayed here um, on my web page. As a matter of fact, you can see here, if I open up SQL Pro, which is a standalone application that just allows you to manage content in your database, you can see here that I have six items in this database, and I've got the um, president's uh, first and last name here, uh, a link to an image here, and then I have uh, some other um, information that's not important. And then I have some info here. So I have uh, several columns here. I've got a date column, an ID column, an employee, an image, an email, a phone, and an info column. So I'm going to minimize that. But you see here that there are six items in this database. So I'm going to go back here to edit. And I am going to notice that I'm using the Cooler SQL Base Div Container version 1.2.0 and also let me point out remember when you're using this stack you have to use a .php page extension okay um, now if you'll notice here in the little sidebar to the right that uh, I've got my server address database name username password and the table name here those are all um, options that you are already familiar with if you've used this stack before but what's new is that you can begin with a certain row and you can tell it to display only a certain number of rows. Now, one thing to keep in mind is that when you begin, if you want the first item in your database to show, you have to, you have to sort of back up a number, or in other words, zero is always considered to be the first item. Whenever you create a database, zero is always the first item that was added to that database, okay? And so I want to begin with zero and I want to display the first six rows, and that's exactly what we just saw. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, and six showing. All right, but let's say that I only wanted to show two rows, and I didn't want to start with the first item. I wanted to start with the fifth item. So this should show me item number five and six. Okay, so let's go here to preview. And actually, I should put that, begin with row four, which should show me five and six. There we go. All right, and if, let's say I wanted to show only one item and have it be the fourth president. There you go. See how easy that is? And so now you can have, you have the power when using this stack to only display the content that you want displayed from your database. So I'm very excited about this updated feature, and I hope that, uh, that you as a Cooler SQL Stack user are as excited about this as I am. Thank you.